I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. And I finally get to put a face to the person that was creating fake accounts to stalk and harass me on social media. I knew it. I knew it was a co-worker. I knew it. So I was scrolling through TikTok this morning and I got a notification saying that someone by the name of Emma viewed my profile. So I'm going to put the picture down here below so that you guys can see and know what I'm talking about. So I recognized the account right away and I went to go block her. When I went to go block her, lo and behold, the brunette at the bottom showed up. And I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. I know this girl. I used to work with this girl. We used to work the same shifts. And when I used to work with her, at least when she was around me, she was very quiet. She kept to herself. She didn't talk much. And when she did talk, like to the customers, to the other coworkers, she was very um, soft-spoken and she spoke very quietly. How creepy and unhinged is that that this co-worker was creating multiple fake accounts using the name emma and somebody else's profile pic to go on my social media and stalk harass and lurk on my account and she would leave such nasty and hateful comments about me but then when she would come in for her shifts and we would work together, like we would literally be standing side by side. She never said one word to me. She never even said hi to me, didn't say nothing to me. She was just, and when I would talk to her, she was, like I said, very soft-spoken and very quiet. But I never, ever felt any hints of animosity or, or jealousy or anything like that so at work she was one way when she was around me but then she would come on my social media pretending to be somebody else and be nasty and rude and disrespectful towards me but she never had anything to say to me while at work like girl that's a lot of time and effort and I didn't even know that, that it was her. Like, I did not know that it was Anne until today. Like, I discovered that today. And I was like, you know, the store manager who is 47 years old and five former co-workers, they all hated me. They all hated me. They all didn't like me. They um, used to act really weird when I came around. And now that I, now that a lot of things are coming to light and I'm starting to discover, you know, different things every day, I realized that their bond and them being cool and always being together, like, like in high school, like, um, a click like that little group over there was based on them hating me. I was the main character. <laughs> it was all based on hating me. They all had one thing in common. They hated me. That there was some kind of animosity and jealousy and all that stuff directed at me and you know like I said you know none of these girls I didn't know them like that we weren't friends we weren't family I never spoke to them I was always quiet and kept to myself I went I I was a good employee I did my job when I was done I I left you know um we never even went out for for a cup of coffee but you know, I wish a lot of this stuff came to light a lot sooner because I would have gotten everybody fired. I really would have gotten everybody fired. But yeah, like I didn't know, like I said, again, I did not know that it was her doing it at the time. I discovered this 
today. But I was like, wow, I used to work next to this girl. I used to work next to Ann, stand next to Ann, and she never had anything to say to me while I was at work. She never ever said anything to me. But she would come on my social media, like I said, pretending to be somebody else. And she had lots to say. She had lots to say. So, mwah. That's, that's it.